Hello Collective and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, I am here doing a random collective love reading for you. I can already feel your person's energy feels like a fool. I, I gotta say there's a song, but I can't quite place who sings it. Um, Something, oh, look what I've done. I've made a fool of everyone. I don't know who sings that song, though, and I don't know what song it is. But anyway, Collective, this reading may not resonate with everyone. So just take what resonates. Leave the rest, okay? Don't try to force it. And thank you so much, everyone, for your likes, subscribes, comments, the nicknames, the smiley face emojis, and all of the love you guys show me every single day. Thank you so much for all of it. Okay, Divine, what can you show me for the collective? Yeah, I'm hearing that song, but I don't know who sings it. Um, oh, look what you've done. Look what you've done. You've made a fool of everyone. Um, oh gosh, I can't think of the name of it, but yeah, I feel like your person feels like a fool. And here you are, Earth Angel Energy, okay? I feel like this person was playing a little game with you, Collective. Smug little game, okay? Um, and I feel like they played it with a lot of people. They liked people chasing after them, okay? It made them feel bigger. It, made, it fed their ego, okay? And they kind of sat back, and I feel like this person waited for you to chase them, but they were dealing with an earth angel. They weren't dealing with just anybody. They were dealing with an earth angel that wasn't going to play. Um, and I feel like uh, they're losing you here because you're already mixing up a new soulmate connection for yourself. Now this person wants to come forward. They're seeing that you're different from everybody else. They were under some kind of illusion like you were going to chase them just like everyone. This could be somebody who's used to that, you know. King of Wands energy is somebody who's very good looking, um, very charismatic, uh, that used to getting what they want. They go after what they want and they get it. You know, they're a king schmoozer. You could be dealing with a, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, maybe a Virgo, Taurus energy. Um, Virgo, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, perhaps. You could be a Sagittarius or a Gemini. Yeah, you've got this person blocked out. You know their game and you're not playing. And now they're feeling like a fool. Look what you've done. You've made a fool of everyone. Okay, they're feeling like a, a fool. I, I, it's They turn their back on a true soulmate connection here. And I feel like this person's been waiting for you to chase them this whole time, and you you never did play their game. So um, I feel like you've healed. You're blocking this energy out. You're detaching. You don't want to have much to do with this person. Um, I feel like, honestly, I feel like this is somebody who can't even work. They're so... I feel like they're so up in their emotions now over this, they feel like a complete idiot. Because they play, they tried to play a game with an earth angel, and they lost you. They had other options. They didn't see that you were different from everyone else, and they lost you. This person, I feel like they're watching you from a distance, and they're seeing you being very abundant. You're a master manifester here because you've got divine abilities. And I feel like, uh, yeah, now they can see everything clearly. Oh, I was messing with, yeah, see, look, they're watching you. They're watching you. And now they realize, you know, they, they could even be working really hard at a job. Maybe that they, I feel like they don't like the job that they're in. They can't even think about anybody but you. And there's no way they can sabotage us. I feel like this person is looking for a way maybe to... Here's the thing. They're making a plan to cause some kind of chaos in your life so that you'll talk to them. Because right now you're not giving them any attention. And like I said, that is not something that they're used to. They're used to getting what they want. They're used to being chased. They're used to people falling at their feet. You know, and you're not doing that. So I feel like this person is... Um, I get the sense that they're, they want to cause some kind of argument 
or something, some kind of argument or fight just to get you to talk to them, Collective. This is a plan. Um, yeah, you're not going to do it, though. I feel like in the Two of Swords energy, you want nothing to do with this person. I got to say, you don't want to have anything to do with anything toxic. And their, their behavior was toxic. They could have already tried to reach out to you and you could have this person blocked. Um, they may be waiting for a response. You're not responding. They're not hearing anything from you at all. You're just uh, doing your thing up here, Earth Angel Energy. You know, um, you could be on doing some kind of mission for the divine. You know, whatever it is. I feel like you're in your north node right now. This person wants to talk to you, collective. Yeah, man. They want to talk to you. You could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. They're realizing here that you're the one that was solid. You're, you're the one that was strong. Um, I feel like... Um, clarify this Ten of Pentacles. This person's realizing you're the one for them. It's like the... Yeah, look, and they're doing nothing but thinking about how are they going to get you two to calmer waters again? How are they going to get you past everything that they've done before? Uh, this person could have said some harsh things to you, treated you poorly. I mean, they did treat you like an option. I feel like they ghosted you, and they sat here and laughed about it while you suffered. And now they don't know how to get back um, into your good graces. All they know is that I feel like, too, this person could be calling you a lot, texting you a lot. And if you have them blocked, you, there's, you, don't, you don't even realize it. They, I feel like they may have already tried to start some kind of argument with you just to get you to talk to them here. They may even eventually send you a bunch of messages saying, you know what, I realize you're the one for me. How can we get past this? I don't think you're listening to them. I don't think you're talking to them. Um, I think you see this person as a liar. You see them as a cheat. You see them as somebody who's just going to deceive you and have in and out energy. And like I said, they laugh about it afterwards. They're laughing in both of these pictures. And I feel like you're just done. You're Right now, you're having a new beginning. You could be getting gifted with um, some like a lump sum of money. You could be buying a new home. This could be a home purchase. Um, maybe even a, a move to a new location. I'm sensing that too. Yeah, you don't want to have anything to do with this person. You, you All they did was lie to you. All they did was show you they were in it for fun. All they want to do is play games. You see this person is just too immature to even speak to. I'm telling you, though, they're going to try to, I feel like they're going to try to be sneaky and um, start some kind of argument with you just to get you talking. Okay, that's the next, that's the next step. I feel like that's what they're going to try to do. And I, I, you're just not even paying any attention to this person. And they're not used to that. I feel like this is somebody who could be very, very good looking. Okay. Um, they're used to being chased. And you're not playing that game. You didn't chase this person. You don't even want to talk to them. I feel like you're about to get somebody new. I feel, I, honestly, I get the sense that this person here is a karmic individual. Okay. Okay that just plays games, wants people to chase them, and laughs about their suffering, okay? And I feel like you're about to get somebody new here that's going to be a divine masculine, divine feminine, um, that's been um, displaced, okay? So say you're a divine feminine, right? Temperance angel, I feel like it's time for you to be loved the right way now. And the divine is bringing the twin flame energies together, but it may not be your twin. It may actually be um, somebody who's displaced. I don't, I even think that this person is a karmic. I got to say, I feel like they're a karmic. Yeah, there it is. 
Oh, look what I've done. Uh, look what you've done. You've made a fool of everyone. What is that song? I'm trying to figure out the name of the song. I don't know who does it though. I don't I don't know. If you guys know that song, please drop a comment, but that's the song that I'm hearing. Now this person is out in the cold. Um, I feel like people around them don't believe them anymore. They kind of see through this person now. They see them for always being immature and playing games. And be, I mean, this is like a narcissist here. And if you don't pay attention to them, they start a fight. This is a narcissist. And now they're feeling like a fool. Okay? They're feeling like a fool. This could be somebody who's impulsive, that kind of thing. They're losing in their life, just so you know. This person is very low on their money. Um, they could be having some really bad health, no opportunities, um, uh, nothing new, nothing is, there's no movement. Once this person gets something new, it's like it's gone right away. It's, I feel like their life is going down, down the tubes fast. And it could be because of their risky behavior. It could be because they're impulsive and they think they're going to get away with everything and they're not. I feel like this person had warnings. You could have even warned this person about a uh, toxic lifestyle. This person could be drinking a lot or they could be a heavy drinker. That's costing them money. It's costing their health. You know, I feel like you, were, you warned this person. And they didn't listen. They thought they could do whatever they wanted. They thought they could hurt whoever they wanted, treat people like they're a joke, lie and betray them behind their back, laugh about it, try to get away. They thought they would get away with everything, but there's consequences for your actions. And this person, um, they acted very immaturely. I mean, in almost every, these three especially, this person didn't think there'd be any consequences to what they were doing, okay? And now they're paying for it. They're, they, they didn't think anything would happen. Now they're headed straight for this. And this is an impoverished, unhealthy, toxic kind of life with nothing but burdens. Yeah, look, they're going down. They're going down. This person has to learn a lesson. This could actually, whatever toxic lifestyle this person has, they could have some major health issues. This could totally lead to the end of this person, okay? I don't, I don't really want to put the energy out there. But, um, yeah, everything that they put out to other people, everything they did behind the scenes, every time they laughed at you and your, and your suffering, they're getting it back. Tenfold, I feel. Tenfold. This is a ten. They're, they're, the divine is making them learn a lesson. See, they make them learn a lesson by, like, you know, I feel taking some things away from this person. They still don't stop what they're doing. They still have some kind of idea that, like, they're, they're still somehow thinking that there's not any consequences when they're already starting to see the consequences, okay? They still don't believe it. And the divine just brings them down even more. Look, you're down, buddy, until you learn this lesson. That's it. I feel like this masculine is angry, upset, watching you, studying you, and you're walking away. You're walking away, you know? Yeah, this person betrayed you for the love that you gave them. They never made it right. They played games with an earth angel. The divine isn't playing when it comes to you. This, this person, they're going down for every, every bit of struggle that they gave you. And I feel like they know that, okay? They know. They know they're, they're about to get their karma, I think, and they're trying to um, keep that away. I feel like other people are starting to go up against this person, people that maybe once listened to them, people that maybe once believed them, because, you know, they did a lot to a lot of people here, not just you, collective. 
It's just that you didn't put any effort in, or energy into this. You, you know, when they decided to ghost you and toy with you and play games with you and have immature energy, I feel like you just kept building on yourself. You didn't put any energy into this, and you're still not putting any ener energy into this. But there's other people in their circle that are going up against them now. You know, here you are. I feel like you're living a wish-fulfilled life. Um, Ten of Cups energy. Happy, happy family, happy home, happy children, right? I feel like you're, um, you're living a pretty comfortable life right now. And your person, not so much. They're getting a lot of pinions shot at them. They're getting ten swords in the back. For, for how they acted. This person is a narcissist, though. And you're about to get somebody new and live this Ten of Cups wish-fulfilled kind of life with this the brand new beginning here. Um, yeah. I feel like you're about to get the soulmate connection of your life. Yep, here it is. There it is. Ace of Cups. You're about to get someone new, and this person, they're done. In some cases, um, depending on how much of a fool they're acting and what they've done, like I said, it could bring on their demise. If they continue to do this and continue to mess with you, because remember, they're trying to start arguments, fights. They're not leaving your energy alone because you're not giving them any energy. They're not used to that. So I feel like if they don't stop messing with this earth angel, the divine is really going to bring them down. Okay, and I don't even really want to put that energy out there, but you're about to get blessed um, with new love, happiness, like you wouldn't even believe, um, a, a true soulmate connection here that's going to stand by you, um, money, you're about to have it all here, collective, and this person from your past, they're going down, they're going down, because they're not really learning the lesson okay they're still acting smug they're still uh, and they're i feel like they're defending themselves too so they're not even admitting to the things that they're doing and the divine's just going to keep giving them their karma until they learn this lesson you know i feel like you're about to they still keep trying i feel like you're about to hear from this person they still keep trying, though, you know? If they don't leave you alone, uh, being an earth angel, the divine is going to bring this person down. They don't have their, they don't have their life cleaned up. Um, this person, like I said, they could be doing a lot of drinking, a lot of lying, um, and a lot of laughing at you behind, the, behind your back. And, you know, the, the spirit is done with this person. Yep, tower. They're bringing them down. It, when this person even tries now to come towards you, I feel like the divine stops them somehow. And I feel like it's little things that are very mysterious. Like, um, like they'll get in their car to come and see you, and the divine will give them a flat tire, or the car won't start, you know. Um, or um, they'll be making some kind of plan to do something to you, and they're going to get all kinds of tripped up. I don't know what it is, but the divine won't let this person near you. Yeah, they're being told, you missed out, pal. You missed out. I feel like they're, um, they're pouty, like a kid, because they can't reach you. You've got them blocked on your phone, maybe, and um, at the same time, the divine won't let them approach. Yep, they, they are locked into their karma now. I mean, they're locked into it. The divine isn't going to let them do what, what they have been doing. They're not going to let them do it anymore. They're not going to let them near an earth angel. You could be dealing with a Taurus. Um, I've got Virgo energy out here, heavy Scorpio, heavy Scorpio, heavy, heavy Virgo so far. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. More Scorpio, guys. Possibly Capricorn, Virgo, 
Aquarius. You could be a Gemini, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, heavy on Cancer, I feel. Uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy. Yeah, man. The divine is not letting this person near you, collective. I feel like they're bringing you in a new soulmate connection that's going to love you like you're not going to. Yep, here comes new love. I'm telling you, and this new person's going to have the victory. You have somebody new coming, and this person is out in the cold. Done. It's a done deal. It is. They are not allowed to come forward. The only thing they can do is think about you now, dream about you now, remember you. You know, all they'll have left is the memory. Really. Anyway, collective, that's what I've got for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Um, if you like this video, please hit that like button, right? Subscribe to my channel if you like this vibe. And until next time, everyone, I hope you have a great Sunday. Take care of you and peace out.